Okay, we're back uh, with the morning brew over here on the old couch. I'm Larry Aarons, along with Amber Hinton. Good morning, everybody. And uh, we're covering a lot of business today, which and dad stuff today. And so. dads, <laughs> and so. dads with businesses. Yeah, exactly. Uh, our guest today is John Mirzwa with Deep Dive Coders, and you're also with CNM. John, mm -hmm. uh, welcome to yeah. the Morning Brew. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Good to have you. At CNM, you're in charge of the. I like the play on words here, Stimulus Initiative. What is that? That is a great new initiative from uh, President Winograd and her amazing team to, to really offer some uh, cutting edge training and education opportunities in, here in Albuquerque. Uh, so some new ways to deliver education that, uh, that will complement kind of the traditional ways we've been delivering education. Beautiful. Now, what about deep dive coders? What, what is that about? Well, it's a uh, web development and programming boot camp. So it's full time, basically 40 hours a week for nine weeks. You really can't have a lot else going on in your life during that time, but uh, people can come in not necessarily knowing anything about programming and come out ready to get an entry level job. So wow. we love that. Yeah, we love that. That's Perfect. Idea. I had uh, seen, had been following what was happening in the Bay Area a couple of years ago when they started this type of program. And then when I, when I got back here in Albuquerque, we are talking to some folks, some uh, recruiters in town, employers, and seeing what the need was here. And there is a big need for programmers and developers here as well. So I uh, decided to, to start one up. And uh, it's been fantastic. And it's a nine-week program, you said? It is. Wow. So 40 hours for nine weeks, mm -hmm. and you start from not knowing a single thing about programming to knowing enough to go and actually enter the workforce. Exactly. And what kind of jobs um, have have some of your talented people landed? Well, Amber, they've been getting some great jobs with some amazing Albuquerque companies, uh, Lavu Inc. Mm -hmm. um, there's a, uh, an app that a, a great crew in, in town have built called Bandojo.us. Yeah. yeah, we've had them on the show. Yes. Okay, great. And so uh, one, of our, uh, one of our graduates uh, went to work with them, helping with that app. Um, W3PR, a great marketing firm in town. Um, Sportcast, which is a startup that uh, captures videos uh, to share for my amateur sporting events. Mm -hmm. uh, so some really, you know, fantastic companies and opportunities. Mm -hmm. And enough that you saw a need. You, you actually were telling me in the break that you were in Las Vegas for quite a while, yes. uh, Nevada. And because of this emerging technology and this business, um, you, you came back out to Albuquerque. What have you seen? Well, I've seen a lot of momentum, especially just in the, the two and a half years that I've been back. Um, what was, what's nice is I've seen an amazing boom there in, in Vegas. And, but when I got there, it was kind of sleepy, kind of you know under the, under the radar. Um, and I see some of those same opportunities here in Albuquerque kind of perking up. And so I think especially with a focus on the tech industry, we have a unique opportunity here in Albuquerque to take advantage of lower cost of living, uh, some great educated people, and uh, so I think we're on the uh, on the upswing for sure. And you're here to stay. Oh, very much so. That's I love good. Albuquerque. That's great. Now, if somebody wants to jump into deep dive coders, is there is it going to start up here pretty soon? Is that what's going on? Uh, we've got a boot camp going right now, but what we're going to be doing is actually in August, starting August 11th, it's going to be at CNM Stimulus Center, uh -huh. downtown Albuquerque. So we're so thrilled to be there. Uh, so if you know if anybody wants to get involved there, they can contact me directly. That's probably the best thing. You can tell them all about it, and uh, that's at uh, jmirzwa1 at cnm.edu. Um, or even my phone number, um, which would be 505-720-1380. And uh, it's going to be a fantastic opportunity. There really are. Uh, the, the change, it, it, I never get over it. The change from the students in the first couple weeks versus the last few weeks, uh, it's just, it goes from this kind of deer in the headlights look to a bunch of developers sitting around writing code and collaborating and building team projects. It's, it's pretty All amazing. in nine weeks. Yes. Incredible. That is so hard to fathom. It is. <laughs> I would be stuck in the deer in the headlights mode. <laughs> For longer than two weeks. <laughs> yeah, I think so. I think I'm still in that mode. I, I love the in, innovation uh, that CNM has come up with to, to provide these kind of programs. That's yeah. very, very innovative, clever, mm -hmm. um, and it's, it, it could extend into some other areas that are very, very good. Very much so. 
You know, that's the one thing about President Winograd and her team. They've always been willing to take some risks. Um, and what I love, too, is it's always working like this with business. You know, education and business should really be married all the time as far as communication and what one needs and the other can provide. And that's what they've always done, and that's, that's what's happening here, too. There's some, some ways to reach uh, certain populations that aren't necessarily attracted to the traditional education sure. route. Um, so this is a way to attract them as well as, you know, others that just uh, want some additional intensive training. And, you know, it is an intense nine weeks, for example, the, the, the coding boot camp, but it's only nine weeks. Mm -hmm. And yeah. so you get in, you get out, and you're Focus. ready to go. As opposed to other degrees, which, you know, you get and you don't know what your future might hold, this nine That's weeks right. you have the hope that your future will hold employment that pays and right. that will have a future. Now, um, is this a, John, is this a shot from the actual boot camp? It or? is. Okay. They're working away on a team project there. Okay. Uh, just having looks fun. Looks like a downtown. Again, another team kind of. Office. They're yeah, just, look. they're collaborating, they're using the tool. See, we also Whoa. actually, we want to instill great habits. So we, we take the students a couple times a week to do a, a workout next door at Rebel Workout. Because you really got to have a healthy body and mind right. if you're going to be. You're sitting all day. You know, right. Code. Looking at a computer you screen. So get out and move a little bit. Right. Promoting good habits. Recharge your brain. Mm-hmm. So that's them uh, hard at work. Uh, but yeah. it's also a fun atmosphere. That's the classes exactly. are not that big. Uh, it looks like it's pretty small. Right. We, we have anywhere from just a few to uh, upwards of, you know, 15 uh, students. And so it's a nice, intimate environment. Lots of one-on-one -on -one time with the instructors. And that's neat. It's fun. This is, this is fascinating. I love it. And then just the fact that these brilliant-minded people are going to stay right here and continue yeah. to work here in Albuquerque. Right. Make our community even stronger. That's the best part. Yes, sure. absolutely. That's the best part. Deep dive coders, and you can uh, learn all about it. Next next group is going to start in August. That's correct. Check in with John if you'd like to get on the program and uh, learn how to be a web developer and a programmer. Boot camp for your brain. Great idea. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, Love hey, John, it. keep us updated on what's going on with the Stimulus Center and, and well. your work. I think it's very, very valuable for the community. Appreciate it. Will Thank do. Thank you so much for visiting us and sharing. Thanks for having us awesome. here on the Morning Brew, and we'll be back with uh, more here on the couch right after this. <laughs>